Y es que te quiero, Scarlett. You know this would happen? Everything changed. Es William Brandt, Oh, santo Dios. ¿Quién coño eres? ¿Eso ha sido adicto a algún tipo de sustancia legal o ilegal? I think maybe on a subconscious level, it's an interesting thing. If, if you believe the movie and are drawn into the movie, and then you rationally think about it and you say, if this could happen to Richard Gere, this could happen to anybody. Now, the reality was is that I'm on the streets. Those weren't extras around me. No one was paying any attention to me. They were actively not engaging. And if it could happen to me, clearly it could happen to anybody. ¿Y su familia? ¿Tiene familia? You have lived, you I will die, you am dying now. Yeah, I, I think it's very, the distance between here and the edge of the cliff is very short. I think it's what makes people anxious. It's, it makes billionaires still want more to create more, as much distance from the edge of that cliff as possible. Normalmente, son los padres los que cuidan de sus hijos. Well, I think it's partnership. I think the best is that it's partnership. I think personal citizens like you and me, I think foundations like Rice, I think governmental organizations and agencies and government money, we all work together. In the end, it's community that saves us. We're very social beings, all of us. No matter who amongst us thinks, well, I'm a loner, <laughs> you know, I'd rather be alone. We thrive when we have social interaction, when we have a community. So when the community takes care of its own problems, of course it's the best. It's personal. Algo va mal en tu cabeza, ¿no estás bien? You know, I, I can't say that I particularly learned anything. I think everything just got deeper. I think it reached a more profound level of understanding. I think one of the things that, that I did feel is that how quickly one can deteriorate on the streets that mentally we are very fragile. And without positive human interaction, uh, we would all fall apart. Te odias a ti mismo, estás deprimido. Dejas de creer en ti. ¿Qué debe hacer la sociedad contigo? ¿Por qué les debería importar? It doesn't work. I mean, every place I go here. <laughs> But it's some peculiar thing. Um, I mean, you've seen the film. It's not like I don't look like myself. I mean, I'm dressed down a little bit, and it's a bad haircut, <laughs> and I have a scar, but it's, it's still basically me. There was something about being in character emotionally and psychologically, and the way I carried myself physically, that it cued a negative response from everyone around me. Tengo la sensación desde hace unos 10 años, más o menos, de que soy un estúpido, un puto idiota, un fracasado. No, no, no. I mean, it doesn't work that way. To tell you the truth, when I set out to make a movie and I say, well, I want to make a movie about a guitar player or a cowboy or whatever it may be, it never works out. I'm always surprised when something comes to me. And I recognize some, something human, something that touches me personally. But I'm usually surprised by something that comes in my direction. This, in particular, this is 12 years me developing the script. And it's one of the few that actually, that I've started to develop that actually turned out well. 
¿Soy una persona sin hogar? No, no, no. ¿Soy solo... una persona sin hogar? Solo te han desahuciado, yo no, no tengo eso. hogar. No existo. Solo te han desahuciado. No existimos. So far. 